I used to suffer from anxiety and panic attacks. I had a fear of failure, it kept on grabbing me back, but that's the norm. I guess that's where insanity's at. Words on my shoulder like I wore a traveling bag. Fully blind though, tame this spasm attack. I'm a savage at rap, plus I'm nice like a lavender bath. I'm quite warm, relax, I'm having a laugh. I'm quite sure if this was ball, I'd be man of the match. A quite storm, a light thought. Tonight's four, cast is to fight war. The mind roars, lion poor, even though that I'm poor, I'm finding divine love, even though I find slaws, lips run round hers, hitting around rounders, a gift and a loud curse, picture inside here, knowing it's nice, clear outside, then left me astray. Hey, listen, okay, that's right, I'm still at it. Top shelf, banging pneumatic up in my attic. You ain't got the lactic acid to rub with me in this rap shit. Take a breath, cause I don't want none of you guys collapsing. Heavy shit, researching with all my fellowship. Dr. Malachi Z York, that Dr. Sebi shit. These clowns still living to wear Giuseppe, it's a design that's been designed for the mind. Look how we cherish things. Violate. I'm selling them phlegm on my estate, the fakes, kids are egging and feds. Another you on my ends got deaded again, and now his whole family's mourning like 7 a.m. Mad. Uh, Type of guy to. Hey, listen. Enjoy it, you get me, fam? It's, it's just it's that Baba TV wave, man. <laughs> Peace and black power, welcome to another uh, edition of Baba TV House of Consciousness Ran into this brother by the name of Jordan, he's from London Shout out to Flavor Swarm, another brother Good brother, the Clay Man from London, and I really appreciate all my London family who are um, listening to Baba TV, Sarnetta TV, the House of Consciousness. You are the reason why we do this. We love you very much, and we just have a quick build with Red, have a few words, and then have a quick build with Brother Red Pill. Yes, like I says, like I says, man. From London, we we we, we feel London you lot, man. Massive. We feel Ooh. you lot, man. Just yeah, for the platform, yeah. the platform, the information. Yes. You get me? Yes. We. Peace to God. Peace. Yes, sir. Right. Indeed, King. Right. No doubt. Peace, yes, my brother. Yes, my brother. Right yes, my brother. Right. Blessings. Mm -hmm. Baba, watch out. Watch out. Yeah, man, yeah. like I say, man, the pla we appreciate the platform, man, it's international, this Baba Sonnet, mm -hmm. it's, it's international, so I just want to show some appreciation to a man like you, you, King, you get me, through the music, the mm -hmm. music as well, like, mm -hmm. fam, no you're giving doubt. his life out here, you're giving his life out here, you get me? No doubt, I, yeah, I, I heard that we blim, I heard we blim, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it's good, man, yeah, man, it's good, it's good, We're just, I just come here, for, I had to come here, cause I'm here for the, uh, for the weekend, do you know what I mean? Yes, so I yes. thought, you know so what, let me... Yeah, had to, had to, yes, had to, yes. you get me, had to. Salute, man. You know Salute. what I mean? But yeah, man. I'm my brother from Africa, right yes, there. Yes, my brother. Yes, my brother. Blessings, man. Blessings. Blessings, man. It's a global thing. It's you international. Know what I mean? It's a global thing. And. Yo, the police was there the whole time? Yeah, they don't want on it. I seen them. I seen them. They want on it. Oh, it is. retarded. But anyway, um, you know, the movement is global. You mm. know what I'm saying? The message mm. is it has no borders. One of the issues that we have as a people is that they put borders in front of us and they created all of these fake demarcation lines because of a different in accent, because of a different in uh, uh, pedigree and creed and whatnot. We all the same. Why are we all the same? We are all the same for many diff many reasons, but one of the main reasons why I find familiarity in all of my brothers is because at the end of the day, we all are here for a reason that reason is basically to have some of the best experiences that each one of us can have while we're here because that's the reason why we came here and we came here with a laundry list of issues to tackle because we don't want to just waste our time you know what i mean what 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 help would it be if i reincarnated with nothing to do 
it wouldn't bring out the best in me. I wouldn't, able, I wouldn't be able to tap into my talents and my skills. The pressure of being in a society where it's almost upside down and backwards is the fact that it will help challenge either eat, uh, the person who is willing to take that challenge is going to make you a better man or woman. Facts all fucking day. You know what I mean? So this is an oppressive culture or oppressive system. You come out of one that I identify as an oppressive system and culture. Why? Because they're lying to you. Because they're holding you back. I'm not. A, I'm not. A, I'm against ignorance. I'm against falsehoods, and I'm against fuck shit in any color, size, shape, form, whatever the fuck. Because we can't just paint one person with the brush. That shit is everywhere. Look around. That's true. true. Decadence is everywhere. You know what I mean? So. If you don't identify as such, you carry yourself in a certain kind of way. You know what I mean? So I don't ever I will never let a thousand miles separate me from that. I would never let a language, a culture, nothing separates from that. What separates from that is when I see my people, I got love for them. A alike, B alike, C alike. It's a vibration. It's a vibe. You know what I mean? It's a frequency. You know, it's nothing else. So salute to you. When I come to your city, I'm going to pull up where you at. You know what I mean? It's the same thing. So, you know, I appreciate you being here. You being here for London, for UK, repping them. That's going to mean a lot. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. So, yeah, man. Yeah. Blessings. Blessings. Like I said, thanks for Baba to having me on here. Yeah, yeah. Yourself, you know what I mean? It's, it's a blessing to... It's a blessing to be amongst you, man. You get me? It's, it's, it's love. It's love, man. man. It's love, you know man. But I'm not really trying to be... I feel like I'm in London, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, it's a, it's a like blessing, man. I'm gonna take two two pictures with you, man. When you when you got time, when you got a little time, take okay. two two pictures. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, let's do that. Let's and then do that. We we'll go from there. But yeah, tell man. us some of the top artists to look out for, cause we in the music and everything. Yeah. Like, who are what? some of the top people to keep our ears out yeah. for? Yeah. Basically, there's 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 artists there's an artist called Two Tone. Yeah. He's, he's very he's very his wordplay is he's a wordsmith. His wordplay. Been about. And I want to say something too. I want to apologize or I want to clear up. Any miscommunications that I may have with my brothers in the UK. Because I remember when the Drake album dropped, I had made a comment about uh, gigs. Gigs, gigs, yeah, gigs. blim, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I didn't necessarily understand everything that was going on with yeah. the movement, yeah. you feel me? Yeah, but a lot of people from the UK hit me about the intricate wordplay, the things that they're talking about. Yeah. The fact that they rhyme differently on the beat than the brothers in America and whatnot. So I have utmost respect. I saw, I went to Miami, I saw, what is his brother's name? Dizzy Rascal? He said, right. He said, this is, this is our mama. He was like, yo, I was just watching your video in the studio. My people's, my, my, my bros put me on. I was like, whoa. You know what I mean? That was an honor. Because I know he a legend. You know what I mean? So the pep is fire, you know. Uh -huh. The pep, your your video is fire. Oh Pe yeah, people yeah. are bumping that. People Prince, are bumping Prince. that. Yeah, Prince, yeah. mate. It's yeah. fire. It's real fire. Them, we gotta get them shows over there. Yeah, popping. yeah, yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah. Definitely, it's growing, man. It's growing. Like yeah. I said, it's, it's growing. In UK, massive. Yeah, man, it's growing, man. It's grabbing. Get that. So Rep King. Representing that. Yes, representing yes. that. You know what I mean? But yeah, there's there's a few artists. Like I'm saying, there's a few artists that are on the on the rise. There's, there's artists called Skepta. I like, I like Skepta. Skepta, yeah, he's, he's like doing his thing right now, you know what I mean? Stormzy as well, he's another young artist coming through, like, about Stormzy. Stormzy's he's coming through, you know what I mean? Like I said, there's a few, but it's expression, innit? It's expression and, course, get, and getting great. That's creative. why we need you to say it. Mm. So nobody, I don't want to listen to the blogs, I don't want to speculate. Yeah, no, nah, in, in the streets, yeah, in the streets, man. The streets tell it. Yeah, man, it's, it's, it's going off, man. It's mm. going off, man, that, that true creative expression, it's, you know what I mean? That's what's up. Without that, it'll be, it'll be a dark space, you know what I mean? people rising up. You know what I mean? Mm. So that's that's a beautiful thing. You know mm, what I mean? Mm, to mm. see the people rising up, to see the fact that the, the the sufferers, the ghetto youth and whatnot, watch out, watch out. The fact that they're basically, you know, becoming conscious yeah. of their African heritage. You know what I mean? They're standing up for, against police brutality, yeah. and they're they're speaking against all of the bullshit that takes place out there. You know what I mean? Yeah. So if I can help. I'm sure that we've been helping with these videos. If we can help any more, you let us know. We'd be on the next thing smoking. You know what I mean? We'd be on Virgin Airlines and shit like that. Yeah, yeah. That's what time it is, man. It'll be that would be a good thing, though. That for you lot, the, the the Baba TV saw it at all, mate. The tour, the, the European tour, mate. Because the the, the 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 information what what you guys are giving us is mm -hmm. is priceless, fam. It's priceless. Mm -hmm. Like like it's saving lives. No doubt. It's saving lives. Like I. I, I go off my own experience. I used to watch the bullshit on TV. I didn't even watch TV no more. 
Yeah. I just watched the, the channel. For your, for your internet. You get what I'm saying? I watched the channel. I watched the, the Baba, the, the Sonetta, and this was information. You know yeah. what I mean? There's another, there's another, there's another, there's another guy that I'm, is, I kind of like, I kind of like his deliverance. Uh, what's his name? Solis, Solis. Mm -hmm. Solis Solari. Who? Solis, Solis. Okay. You get me? You ever, you ever heard of him? He's from, he's from, he's from, he's from mm -hmm. out here, but you know what I mean? He's good. You get me? There's obviously there's this Seti, mm -hmm. Seti, um, Pharaoh. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? He's, 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 he's good. You get me? Yep. Obviously yourself. Sutek, where's Sutek? He's Sutek. in Georgia. I just seen him. Yo, Sutek. And Larry as well. Larry's Larry. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. Professor Larry. You might find him. He might come through today. Yeah, Larry, man. Larry, I like Larry's delivery, man. He, he, he paints mm -hmm. the picture clear, you know what I mean? He paints yeah, it clear. Because yeah. that's another thing, it's... With the, with the information, it's about it's about painting the picture clear. Mm -hmm. So someone who's not really... There. There can grasp it, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's why... That's why I, yeah, that's why I got to give thanks for you, man, because you, you, you paint it clear for, man, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. no you doubt. get me? So no that's what it is, man, that's what it is. Being out here taught me that. Mm. People skills, people skills. Just, yeah, building with people every day mm. of all different backgrounds, of all different tax brackets. Yeah. Uh, people who are tourists. Yeah. They want to ask questions and they want to build. Mm. Uh, you know, building with the, the, the shooters, the killers. Mm. Like they said, and I'm not comparing myself to Christ. I'm, you know what I mean? But I'm, I'm explaining the parable that they have in a book that he was amongst the hitters. He was amongst the shooters. You can find him with the hoes, with Mary Magdalene. He was with the divine whore. You know what I mean? So you got to be able to identify with some of the people who are in some of the darkest places in their lives right now. Why? Because simply, if you're able to penetrate the wall of denial that sometimes they put up, and throw a seed over there and then water that shit. Yeah. You could grow an oak tree. And then you could find yourself with a Malcolm X on your hands. I don't want to give up on my people. It's not real. Shit is hard. It's not real. Yeah, I don't want to give up on our people. Our people have given up on themselves in some in situations. But there's a lot of people who have not. And they deserve to be enlightened. That's about, I, I, I could, you know, that's about it. Like, what I could give a person is enlightenment. I don't know about nothing else, but if I could help them with that, well, God damn it, I just gave you a motherfucking gift that, that keeps on giving. Planting that seed, planting mm -hmm. that seed. I hear yeah. that, planting that seed. So let me ask you a question then. Mm -hmm. what, what, what USA artists are you feeling at the moment? Okay, that was a good one. There's this brother out of uh, BK by the name of Red Pill. Red Pill? Yeah, Red Pill. He got a twin brother by the name of Blue Pill. The Pills. Yeah, they, yeah, the yeah, twin yeah. pillars. Yeah, yeah. Nah. Kendrick Lamar is my favorite artist right now because of the fact that he is a poet slash rapper slash, you know, visionary. Like, I just love that album that he just put out. Um, J. Cole, I rock with, you know what I mean? I love, I love the fact and, and, and their music speaks to what we were just talking about with our consciousness. They paint the picture clear. Yeah. He's a millennial consciousness. That's a difference. Millennial consciousness is not the same as that golden era consciousness. It's consciousness that says, look, I'm a fucking a millennial. Like, nigga, I'm a drink. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? I'm a turn up. Yeah, I'm, yeah. A, I'm a dab on these yeah. niggas. You know what I'm saying? It's honest, it's I'm a, yeah, I'm going to be honest and transparent, but I'm going to be woke as fuck. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm going to drop gems. I'm not going to fold. You're not going to see me with a dress on. Yeah, Shit like that. I'm not going to... I'm going to bang on the beast, but I'm not going to do it the way that y'all might have done it. I love those millennials. You know what I mean? Because it brings, they... It brings, it brings a new generation in as well. You know, like the, the youngers, they, they, can, they, they can flex with it, but... There's, 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 there's gems in there. Facts. And it's a level of freedom. Remember, consciousness could be a prison too. Consciousness could be a box too. Consciousness is almost a fucking religion in some places. So people threw away the Bible or they threw away Jesus and picked up Heru. You know what I'm talking about? And then they worship and teach us like people will worship a preacher and a pastor. You know what I'm saying? So... The millennial consciousness is sort of like, yo, I'm working on me. I'm listening to that person, but I'm not living vicariously through them. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not, yeah. I'm not parakeeting every fucking word that they say. Yeah, yeah, I hear that. You know what I mean? Yeah, I I'm not attached to people to the place where 
you seen some of our mamas and grandmamas and all of these other, they didn't want to hear nothing. They were blinded by the gospel. You know what I'm saying? So I, I have appreciation for that. Um, J Electronica. Eh, yeah. He hasn't delivered much lately. You know, um, Cambada. The brother who worked on me on my project is a fucking monster. He's a beast. I'm gonna check him out. Yeah, Cam Bada. Um, Absol. You know, I like TDE. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, but it, I like Styles P. His new project. Everybody that's on a conscious wave. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, I yeah, fucks yeah. with them. Yeah, 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 Styles yeah, yeah. P. With the Talib. Immortal Technique. Yeah, yeah. Um, there was somebody else that just went conscious. Somebody else, somebody else, they, they, they did a total 360. Shit, I heard, uh, who is this? I heard one of the dip sets going in the other day. It might have been J.R. Ryder. I don't, I'm not. I know, you know what I thought about J.R. Ryder the other day, you know? Yeah. I'm thinking, I'm thinking where's, where's J.R. gone, man? Because it was, it was tight back in the day. It was, one, of it, them is, one of them is all the way up. Yeah. One of them had woke the fuck up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, matter of fact, a lot of them, Duke the God. Yeah. Uh, cause they, yeah, Hellrell had some shit where he was spitting, um, you know, so, my thing is this, there's a movement taking place, all movements need soundtracks, when Nina Simone and them threw their hat in the ring in the 60s, it galvanized the movement and gave it a soundtrack, so, the artists that I'm rocking with is the ones who are making soundtrack, I'm fucking with T.I. with that us or them, I salute the brother for, you know, at least attempting, huh? Taking the stance. Taking the stance. You know what I mean? Rick Ross album, that shit is fire. He's giving you boss consciousness yeah, 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 yeah. or Ross consciousness. Yeah. Somebody would be like, yo, he's a he's a fake because he wasn't a gangster. I'm good with that. I didn't want him to be a crack fucking dealer. I didn't want him to be a willy, you weirdos. He's a fucking entertainer. I'm cool with a person not being who the fuck they say that not really being that person and being an entertainer and turning into a character. I'm a child of hip hop. I have accepted that at this point. Cool G rap wasn't killing niggas in time. Well, yeah, maybe he was, but no, nah, I don't know. But motherfucker, Ice Cube was a genius. He was like a, a, a homebody. And he was America's most wanted and all this nigga is from Are We There Yet and all of this crazy shit. Like, I'm good with that. Because I'm not worshipping the artists. I'm only respecting their artwork. Yeah. Yeah, it's all. It's a fucking art. You know what I mean? Like my dude from the wire to play the uh, Omar, the homo thug, like I know that that's not him. And if I saw him, I wouldn't act like, you know what I mean? And I don't think that he's going to pull a shotgun out and try to rob me. He's a thespian. I see him as a great actor. You know what I mean? So the whole thing with these artists, yo, I'm just there for the motherfucking comments and the music. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't get caught up in a personal life. Uh, you know what I mean? And, and if they really kill people and all of that, I don't got time for that. I know that his music put a lot of young men in jail when it first came out. Because we... The, the music makes impressionable It's impressionable So to see maturity And to see somebody brave enough to tell His listening audience to think What the fuck What are we gonna do Persecute them still You know what I mean Like I'm about growth and development Even if it's inches I'm still about growth and development We have to be very patient with our people We cannot be so goddamn uh, puritanical with our consciousness to where it's almost like we're fucking Jesuits, we're, we're, you know what I mean? So um, we, we, we almost whipping niggas like we goddamn Saudi Arabians on niggas. Like, huh? You know what I mean? We can't do that because this is not a religion. This is what is known as the path of enlightenment. And consciousness is the exit on the road of the path of enlightenment. It's where you stop off to get more enlightened. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's a fucking journey. And everybody's on an individual journey. So how you go about your journey is none of, I cannot hold you. I'm not, yeah, like, I'm not policing your box. And I'm not policing your phallus. And I'm not pocket watching. And I'm not telling you what you could think and say and study. Your legacy is yours, my nigga. If that shit is on your jacket, that's going to be on your jacket. That don't got nothing to do with me. You made the decision. So. But yeah, man. I, I just want, I want to sign out. I got a, a little few, few bars. A few bars. Yeah? All right.
I used to suffer from anxiety and panic attacks. I had a fear of failure, it kept on grabbing me back, but that's the norm. I guess that's where insanity's at. Words on my shoulder like I wore a traveling bag. Fully blind though, tame this spasm attack. I'm a savage at rap, plus I'm nice like a lavender bath. I'm quite warm, relax. I'm having a laugh, I'm quite sure if this was born, I'd be man of the match, a quite storm. A light thought, tonight's four, cast is to fight war. The mind roars, lion poor, even though the I'm poor, I'm finding divine love, even though I find slows, lips run round hers, hitting the rounders, a gift and a loud curse, picture inside here, knowing it's nice, clear outside, then left me astray. Hey, listen, okay, that's right, I'm still at it. Top shelf, banging pneumatic up in my attic. You ain't got the lactic acid to rub with me in this rap shit. Take a breath, cause I don't want none of you guys collapsing. Heavy shit, researching with all my fellowship. Dr. Malachi Z York, that Dr. Sebi shit. These clowns still living to wear Giuseppe, it's a design that's been designed for the mind. Look how we cherish things. Violate. I'm selling them phlegm on my estate, the fakes, kids are egging and feds. Another you on my ends got deaded again, and now his whole family's mourning like 7 a.m. Mad. Uh, Type of guy to. Hey, listen. Boy, you get me, fam? It's, it's just. It's that Baba TV wave, man. That's a free CD, I gotta sign it. Yeah. Like, that Baba TV, know. man. Yeah. You get me, man? Yeah, my sign TV, up, man. You know what I mean? But yeah, man, it's, it's that, it's that, that's what I'm saying. It's that, it's that. It's that, it's that expressing like without without the, the expression like man's mind will be boggled and you get mad about the information and let me share something with you because i heard you talk about anxiety right and the fact that you know the expression of your art is therapeutic in a sense that this is what we have to do because nobody understands the mind or the pressure that we go through as black men, aboriginal, indigenous, whatever you want to fucking call it. You know what I'm talking about. We all going through it together. What I'm saying is, I can't fathom what they go through. So I don't know if they can fathom what we go through as well. Because I sit down with my sisters and we build. Peace, 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 peace. And some of the things that I hear, I be like, God damn. You been through some shit, sis. You know what I mean? I'm, 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 I'm shedding tears inside. Yeah. And we have to be able to express ourselves. That's why art is so very important. We have to be able to express ourselves. The fact that they have taken our expressions and monetized it, commodified it, and they, they turned that shit into a racket. You know what I mean? That's crazy. Like, these videos, me being able to get this information out, mm. like, art it's art in itself. Art like, in itself. people don't understand the anxiety that some people have when they're holding on to information and there's no outlet to get it out. What do you see? You see them niggas on Lexington talking to themselves. Dope fiends, nodding. They get into the drugs. They try to escape. Because they don't feel like this reality is where they want to be because they have not been able to build with the network to say, no, my nigga, you're not crazy. I feel like that, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So a lot of people on Ward's Island has lost their minds. Motherfuckers walking up and down these streets talking to themselves. No Bluetooth, no Wi-Fi. Yeah, yeah, true. You know what I mean? And they are doing some of these things because they did not have an outlet to express themselves. They did not have an outlet to basically um, communicate with their people about tell Frank to move up. They didn't have an outlet to communicate certain kind of ideas and concepts to their people or when they did it, motherfucker was like, yo, you crazy. Yeah. Get out of here. Yeah, yeah. That shit is cuckoo. Yeah. You know what I mean? You wildin'. Like, you know what I mean? So, I'm gonna leave it on this note. These days and times is not the same as the days and times of three years before and times like that. These days and times, you have to find yourself amongst people who are on the same frequency yeah, yeah, yeah. as you. Yeah. I don't, look, don't Very leave, important. don't throw your family away because we have to cherish family because we don't have family structure. Yeah. That, that is a weakness. If we don't have the power of the family structure, we cannot be as strong as we want to be. So you don't leave your family because they're not conscious. Yeah, no. But you have to have a network. Remember Ralph Cramden and them? Remember he had the Elks Club? Exactly. Some of our grandfathers were Masons, not mine. Wait a minute. Woo! Woo, yeah. <laughs> some, of our, some of our grandparents, some people got Masonic uncles. Masonic uncles, uh, the Masons are called fraternal orders before the spooky shit. Social clubs. 
Remember, bada bing with the mob, they have social clubs. Mm. Being able to, so, how you can't talk mob shit to the therapist. Mm. You saw that on The Sopranos. He had to go amongst Paulie and them. Mm. To talk mob shit because they don't under, should the therapist wouldn't understand that. We have to develop outlets. You motherfuckers go to meetup.com or somewhere, create meetups. You know what I mean? Yeah. So you can express yourself. Don't express yourself on my timeline. Stop that. Stop expressing yourself on fucking YouTube, you know, uh, Facebook Live and just going manic depressive. Yeah. No. <laughs> Fine. I mean, jackpot is when you could get you a queen who will be receptive yes. to your expressive expressions and also give it back to you. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's therapy. That's healing. Yeah. That's the shit that's going to make us whole again. But if you can't find that, find some people in your neighborhood, in your hood, in your online community, develop groups, begin to talk. People that are suffering from depression, anxiety, and all of these other things that have uh, basically brought our energy down, have compromised our mental health, spiritual health, it's time for healing. It's time for all of that. Don't get in no groups where you niggas are just arguing all day. Training, training energy. No. Drain, va energy vampires. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Motherfuckers just call you to suck energy. No, True. fuck that. True, you know? Nothing has been gained from that. No. Nothing whatsoever. But a bunch of people who used to be cool, now they're not cool because of uh, 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 tangible reasons that you may, you may evolve and be like, damn. I knocked my I knocked my homie out because he was on some other shit that I wasn't. But now I'm on. Now I've evolved. I got a you know no don't do that. You're going to need people that are close to you, close to you in the upcoming times that we are going to be facing. It's going to be a fucking zoo out here in a minute. It's gonna be crazy in a minute. There's something called the perpetual war, the 100 year war. That's what's being planned. The, the wars never stop, and they're, going, they're only going to increase. So with that being said, you got to have a strong motherfucking support system. Got to have a strong team. When shit, Let's say that we wake up tomorrow and the dollar fell. You got to be able to have some niggas that you know is not savage, and they won't try to rape your wife, and they won't try to fucking gut you, and they won't try to run up in your crib and take all of your fucking Cheetos. You understand? Yeah, it's true. It's not real. It's not real. Not real. It's survival time, it's revival time, and it's time to strive. I mean, the world is going crazy, but if you take your energy to try to correct all of the craziness around you, you're going to be a fucking nutso. Let it go. Let this shit fly. If these niggas don't want to pro, look at this shit. If these niggas don't want to procreate, if they don't want to be fruitful and multiply, if they don't want to find their natural opposite on this planet, and they are practicing what is called species terminus, where the species terminates themselves, so be it. You can't control people. You can't police niggas' phallus. You can't police women's yonis. You know what I mean? It's beyond your control. Do you. Make sure you don't fall into the sunken place. Make sure you don't fall under the motherfucking spell of King Goo or whatever you want to call it. All right? So love and light to the family. All right? Peace to the, peace to the fam. Peace to the global community. One.